Hey friends, welcome back. And if you're new to my channel, I welcome you. I'm back with a Bath & Body Works mini haul, you guys. I had a Bopis order that I needed to pick up. I picked up a couple more candles, um, as well as some extra goodies. And I also participated in the Wallflower sale. So if you guys haven't checked out my recent video, I just uploaded where I reviewed the new Irish Cream Pound Cake Wallflower. I paired it with the Daisy Wallflower plugin from Bath & Body Works. So be sure to go back and check out that video. But in this haul, this is just a mini haul of wallflowers that I picked up during that $3.95 sale and also a Bopis order for a few more things that I decided to pick up. So first I'll start with the Bopis order. And this is the candle that I picked up, you guys. Like like this candle is going to sell out it has sold out already I wanted to pick up two more because I feel like this one won't be back for quite some time and it's so popular and it's every bit worth the hype seriously so the fragrance notes are here on the bottom it smells like vanilla wafers and the banana pudding filling that's what this candle smells like it burns beautifully be sure to pop on and check out my review of this candle it's absolutely wonderful 10 out of 10 in my opinion i will continue to buy this one and others if they continue to make candles just as good as this one so um i love the color of that wax it's super beautiful for easter I love this you guys i'm in love with this candle so okay so i did pick up two of the main street bakery candles and this was before uh, the candle sale went bye bye and then lastly in my bopis order um a store had some additional socks so i did pick up more of these shea infused easter socks you guys these socks are every bit worth having, wonderful as a gift, wonderful for Easter baskets. So if you were able to get your hands on these, lucky for you, um, I have been enjoying the pair that I have. Um, although if you wear them much, they will get quite dusty because of the light colors, but um, giving it a good wash, they should be fine. But these do shed like crazy. So you will get a lot of shedding from the actual material of the socks. I actually find the shedding to get quite annoying, but um, these socks are so soft and I just don't want to be without them. So I did pick up a few more for my daughter and just some extras to have um, for gifts. So I picked up four of the Shea Infused Easter socks. So super happy about being able to get some additional ones of these. Like I mentioned, lucky you if you were able to get these. Hopefully they will restock. There are so many people that would love to be able to experience these. And I really hope Bath & Body Works decides to do a restock prior to Easter. So that's everything for my in-store pickup. Um, now I'm gonna share with you all the wallflowers that I picked up during the sale. These out the way. Okay, so I picked up many wallflowers, you guys. So I feel it's best that I just dump out all the wallflowers in the bag because there are many wallflowers, but many are in the same scent. So, so I try to be consistent and just pick up the wallflowers that I'm loving or wanting to experience. And the one that I did want to experience that I purchased many of is the Irish Cream Pound Cake. And I do like the design for this. This is a new limited edition one that was released um, this spring. So here are the fragrance notes. Irish Cream Liqueur Fresh Baked Pound Cake Chocolate Caramel Drizzle. And this one came off of the one I currently have. Uh, one placed inside my daisy wall plug and i just plugged up another one in another room um, because the one that i currently have plugged up is a little bit defective so i plugged up another one in another room to test to see if the throw is much better and it actually is personally in my opinion the irish pound cake it's throwing better in my smaller room um, but the one that I reviewed in my latest video, I noticed that wallflower is a bit defective. So it's probably why it wasn't pumping out as strong as I wanted it to. But this one smells really good. It's very heavy on the pound cake. So um, your entire space will smell like a fresh baked pound cake. Not necessarily a buttery pound cake, but more like a drier 
chocolate pound cake. Um, my particular batch does smell more chocolatey. I wasn't getting much caramel, but I'm still enjoying this one and it's limited edition. I don't think this will be back for quite some time. So I wanted to stock up on it. My husband also really loves the scent. He said this smells scrumptious. So I want to say I picked up close to like 16 of these. So here's another one here. Here's another one here. I do have a few more that are not Irish cream pound cake. I picked up Springtime in Paris. This is also another favorite wallflower scent that I enjoy during the spring. The candle is absolutely beautiful. So if you're able to experience and get your hands on the candle, I highly recommend Springtime in Paris. It's beautiful. Um, the fragrance notes for this is Soft Peach, Lotus Blossom, Fresh Bergamot. So this one is another one that is very springy. Um, it's a light, fruity, peachy scent. I love this one, you guys. So I picked up a couple of the springtime in Paris. Here's one right here. Here is another one right here. And uh, four. I have four of the springtime in Paris. And I have about, I'm guessing about 16 to 18 Irish cream pound cakes. I had a 20% off coupon, so it knocked the wallflowers down to $3.25. So really good deal in my opinion. I do prefer to pick up the wallflowers um, at a $3 under price point. But with the limited edition scent coming out, I didn't want a chance to wait to get wallflowers at that lower price and not be able to experience some of the newness. So I hope that makes sense, you guys. And I really hope you guys enjoyed this mini haul. Comment down below, are you guys participating in the upcoming wallflower sale? Are you finding that your stores are stocked well with wallflowers, um, especially the limited edition Irish cream pound cake? What are your thoughts on the scent itself? Have you guys gotten a chance to experience this one yet? I would love to know. Also with your local stores, what's the tea for restocking the Easter socks? I came across a store that's about 25 minutes away from me that had a few more left. So I placed an order and that's how I ended up with the additional one. So be sure to subscribe to the channel and also like the video if you enjoyed this and I'll talk to you all in my next video. Bye.